Hey, what's up, Never Conquer? How you doing? How's your morning going? What the heck? Oh, it's an invisible... It's an invisible knight. Okay, he's dead. I think that's like a bug with the arch file. Because I've noticed invisible monsters whenever there's an arch file around, so like... Maybe it resurrects them, but they, they resurrect invisible sometimes. Or maybe it's not a bug, maybe it's a feature. I don't know, I never fought this many arch files before. I've fought more arch files today... ...in just this single day... ...than I've ever fought in my entire life. out on a shotgun ammo. <laughs> Alright, I'll go down the gore tunnel. Yeah, another arch file. It looks like there's one back there, too. What hit me? Okay, well the other plan I can I have is to just run right up to it and hit it with as much plasma as I can, as I got. Switch there, got purple ooze. Lots of purple ooze. There's a lot of oh no. And thank you for the host! For a second there I thought there was the cyber demon that said, oh yeah, I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> There's a cyber demon! <laughs> It was su- <laughs> the, the sound clip played, exactly. <laughs> oh. You see what sucks about fighting him in like an area like this? He'll hit the wall with his um with his rockets, right? And that'll get you. Oh, and also there's this pit, but you know, that's not Okay, maybe if I just get really close to him and give him a hug, maybe he'll he'll like not kill me. Why am I over here? Where's oh there it is. Alright, here we go. No no it didn't work. Actually my plan was to get really close to him and then circle strafe him. Because I'll, I'll strafe faster than he can turn. I like how he just spits out, too. Like someone throws him out of that hole. Like his girlfriend's like, you go get a job! I'm tired of it. Go kill that dude, Marine. Be useful. Jesus. I never knew the 
took this many plasma shots to kill a cyber demon. You know, because usually I, I end up fighting maybe one per episode, you know, not, not a whole bunch. Okay, so what's going on here? Oh yeah, that was very helpful. That was worth spawning a cyber demon. another switch that I missed. That just leads back around. That pretty much leaves this place. Wait, where am I? Oh yeah, over here. Okay, so I've been here before. And there's another arch file. I don't know, I can't see him, but I know he's here. with the step. It did nothing. Like that all it did was just spawn a bunch of chain gunners. Missing one key. And again, there's one switch left. Hmm. Bunch of candles in the dark. Back to there. Are these like plat? Do I have to follow the circle of light? Hey, what's up, Nocturne? How are you doing? I mean, can I just go over here? No, I can't. I have to follow the light. Until this happens. Oh, there's the blue key. I wonder. Hmm. Is it going to be another infinite imp? Give me a lot of rockets. And a, and a megasphere. Oh, no, 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 it's not as bad. This time it's just a whole bunch of pinkies. And the green ones. And I'm dead. I'm pretty much cornered. It's like a teleport. Oh. Let's see. They give me rockets. Rockets against the pinky demons. Yeah, it's been a long stream. Possibly the longest one I've ever done. But I'm like, I, I gotta beat this thing. Or at least beat this episode. Like... Like, if they gave me plasma ammo, that'd be great. But no, they give me rockets. Rockets to fight pinky demons. You know how sadistic that is? Alright, well, I'm gonna save. See, that's why. That's why it's... Because they'll close the gap. You got you got no choice. They gave me cell ammo, I could kill them. But, like, now it's like, I guess I gotta, like, move around and... Okay, well, at least it's not nearly as many... 
as those imps. Same setup though. The imps were worse. What? What's that noise? What the fuck? Oh. God, I hate the fact that it has that chain gun. Mastermind is dead. Gone, it's dead. I'm looking for health. Grab that. Go. This. Well, this opened up. Uh, I guess that's why there's that step. find health might be some like somewhere maybe some like in a corner that I didn't see uh, all ammo yeah, at least I can get that armor There's health up there, but I can't get up there, so... Well, I mean, I probably can, I just don't know how to get up there. Oh, good. Right, it's time to activate the three keys. Wait, wait, what's over here? Oh, nothing. Into the darkness? Yay, into the darkness! Tribulation. There, there is still more. And it has the spookiest music! Come on! Thank you, Nipple Jesus. Okay, let me get out this gun. There we go. Arch file. I dare not turn this corner. Okay, there's nothing there. Something's in there. That's not a switch. 
Well, that means it's, that's the only place to go. It's pretty straightforward. And I lost it. Like, where the hell is it? It had, like, knights and shit, like, hanging out on top of a wall. Oh, it's this place. Here we go. thing, like, as a last resort. Here, let's use this. DPS him, but apparently not. Now we got steps. come from? From this area, that's where he came from. Damn it! So there's an arch file in there. Or in there, right? Okay. What causes him to spawn? It's not the death of the, uh, arachnid. considering. Or all things considered, rather. Uh, let's see, where's, was there any health? No, there never is. Wait. Oh, I thought there was health behind him. Oh, Berserk! Thank God. And I'm not gonna use it for, I'm not gonna punch anything, but it's nice to have 100 health. The thing is, what's supposed to happen? Like, there's no switch or anything, there's no key. It's not like this leads somewhere where I couldn't go.
what's behind here. Oh, that's... What's this level called? Tribulation? Should, should be called Home of the Arch Files. I never got to appreciate exactly how tough they are until now. Oh, this is not good, is it? No, it, no, no it's not good. Oh, I see. Yeah, that's cute. Cute. I should have started shooting him earlier, to be honest, Nocturne. I was just seeing where the hell that was going. I don't even want to save, because I have 15 health. Because I think I could handle that encounter a lot better. seen those in a long time. They're the worst. Okay, I'll save now that I have like 65 health. What's up, Peppy? Yeah, apparently I'm still streaming. Whoa. Oh, he's dead. Okay. Is that this episode won't end? Like, I thought the last map was the last map of the episode, but, but no. I don't think that purple stuff, that's not the purple ooze, so it doesn't hurt me. What's this switch do? Torment is, is is ongoing infinite torment. Alright, let's see what's going on here. Oh, an invisible asshole. Okay, good. What's going on over here? Maybe if I get this out. You know, it, it's like Pinhead said, um... In Hellraiser, it's like, your suffering will be eternal. It's like, I guess it is. Alright, well, six... Wait, no, nine health. Alright, we're good. That's... That's better than six. 
Well, that one lowers too, so there's four of them. Four of them. That was me. That was my bad. And now I have six health. Now I'm doomed. Oh, so close. It's that chain gun. Who, who thought it was a good idea to give him a chain gun? Come on. A rocket launcher wasn't enough. Just trying to get that help. Maybe plasma? What's this side like? No, there's no health on that side. What level one is this? It's uh, evil. I think it's called Evil Eternity. Oh, it doesn't say. You know, it's like evil, but it, it lasts an eternity, which is kind of fitting. You can find it on Realm 667, like that website. Yeah, it's Evil Eternity, because I was getting it confused with Evolution, but that's Final Doom. Which at the time was considered the hardest, but no, no, no. No, they, that was like... That was barely... that was the tip of the iceberg compared to something like this. This is just, like, wow. That's right. Oh my god, you and your stupid... chain gun bullshit. Uh, ultra-violent. Yeah, it does. The neon, like... Oh, they're tough. It wouldn't be so bad. I just had enough health to survive one hit. You know what I mean? Like... But I can't even survive, like, the chain gun or, like, the splash damage from, like, five feet away of a rocket. Or if there was just a way I could get to that health, like, without getting chain gunned to death. Actually, you know what? There is a way. Oh, I got it!
Oh fuck. There's four of them, you know. get to it. <clears throat> like, I'm trying to get at least three rockets off. Like, at least that might hurt him a bit. And I got chain gun. Like, I can't even, like, straight fit it out because they'll hit me with that rocket because of the hallway. Fuck. Why? Why do you have to use the chain gun? Seriously, like, why, why can't you just shoot a rocket at me? I can dodge a rocket. Fucking asshole. I can't do anything against the chain gun, it's just gonna hit me. Fuck me. Alright, um, hmm. Chainsaw Room flashbacks? Is it as desperate as the Chainsaw Room? It feels like it. I gotta like, I gotta try and whittle them down, like... But how do you kill them? You can't even like look at them for four seconds because they'll kill you. See? Or they'll use that... It, well, they'll use that chain gun. If I just had enough help to survive the chain gun, it wouldn't be that big of a deal. I can't leave so it's like I gotta make do with the health I have and the weapons I have right now okay maybe I'm approaching this like maybe I should be a lot more defensive like just try to lure him to one side of the map and then make a run for it for the health
Fucking chain gun. Oh, they fight each other? Oh, that's interesting. I did not know that. Now that I know that, there's there's hope. For the first time in a long time, there is hope. A small one, but it's there. I killed one of them. <laughs> Got greedy on that one. I want to try to get at least four rocket shots off. I got some of them fighting them, the other one. Hey, where'd this Revenant come from? What's he doing here? He's, he wasn't invited to this. He wasn't invited to the purple room raid. And yet another challenge has been passed. I mean, how many times did I die? Like 20? Maybe 30? But it is done. They're dead. Why put it there? Okay, so there's the switch. fight these guys, that's fine. And the thing didn't lower, of course. Why why should it? Is there like a way I can kinda of jump there? No, not really. But I'm at a hundred health. That's all that matters now. I guess you drop down, so I gotta like get up there and then drop down. Now don't worry, the 100 health doesn't last long.
Yep, it's totally gone, but... Oh, shit. Oh. Aha! But now I have 200 health and 200 armor. Behold! Voila! Oh, look at that. It's like a penis glyph. I'll press that later. See, it's transparent. You get close to it and you can see the stairs. Yeah, you can take that green armor. I don't need it. Oh, and, uh, and that? I don't need that either. This I need. Oh crap, I thought I could make that. What's happening? Oh shit. I like how there's just one, like, astral plane cacodemon. Okay, no, there were two. I'm sorry, there were two. Silly me. as tough as those four assholes, that's for sure. Exit? Yeah, 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 I believe that. How do I get back to that that mega sphere Or that, like, suit, you know, blue sphere? Oh, all the doors are closed now? I guess I have no choice but to take the exit. Yes, I have no choice. I have to go here. Where it just says exit. Gossamer. Wow, what the fuck? And a chainsaw, oh man. <laughs> You're not too I could go back and play regular Doom anymore. I'll be like, you know what? I, I don't know. Unless there's like maybe 10 or 20 arch files in this level, I, I just don't feel the challenge anymore. Uh, what? The level only has 20 revenants? That's it? Switch. Look at that. Nonsense, get this rocket crap. <laughs> of 
Yeah. Okay. I'll save because, you know, you... Par for the course, that's something... No, oh, nothing happened! Dead Doomarine. Another dead Doomarine, so don't jump down there. Or maybe you should jump down there. Okay, that's that place. Where'd that one shot come from? Finish that off. More crap going on there. So no, no. Oh no. Hmm. Stairs that lead here. See what's over here. Berserk. Didn't really need it, but okay. Wait, does this blood hurt me? No, it doesn't. It's just blood. Not magical, hurt you blood. Oh, that's why there's stairs leading there. Okay. It's just normal blood. None of that weird hell blood that hurts you for some reason. How do you get over there? Right. And thank you, Mazanaga, for the follow. Nope, still can't get over there. I guess I jump in the blood, huh? Now that we've established the blood doesn't hurt me. And thank you, the Yogi Bear. What? Ow. No, even the bricks bleed. Oh, look, 
look and there's mancubuses up there. Really enjoy the stream, well thank you. What, what, oh, I thought you were dead! And another Arachnotron. I killed. I think there's like one Mancubus left alive. I might have killed him though. I think I did. I don't hear him and he's not like coming out. So I guess I'm okay. I hear a lot of imps, but you know, they're imps. They're mischievous like that. Did I hit that? I did. Okay, now I hit it. I did kill both of them. Oh no, that looks terrible. Okay, no, it's it's nice. Yeah, nothing bad happens here. It's just it's, it's just this, and then someone's library, just randomly here. Someone's picture of their mom. Now let's see, let's get that. Oh, that's not a switch. Okay, here's the arch files. Look, how dare you make fun of my mother? She was a saint! Nine health! Any, any cool books to read? No? What's this picture? Oh, okay. Oh. That open a door. Oh, a flesh staircase that descends into madness? Okay. Looks like there's health there. Two more. Oh, well, that solves that problem. Weird hell house thing going here. Doesn't open. Two switches. What's over here? You know, it's the chain gunner window that really makes it. That's that's what really brings the room together.
Let's try to switch this out. Well, I don't know what good that did. What about this one? No, it's like endless content, ours. I, I never feel like I run out of stuff. There's still map packs I want to check out, too. I can name, like, about ten of them. Like, there's the Valiant map pack that I think is pretty good. Yeah, this one's recent. This one's this year. Wow. And yet there are more of them. It seems like people are getting better at making maps. But then again, I guess that makes sense, right? We've only had, what, like, 26 years to get good at making maps and, and getting good at the game? <laughs> Blue key. Alright, I don't have that. I have the yellow key. And red key for that. That's a window. A window into my soul. Oh. Oh no, this is more of a window into my soul. And I get into this imp room. I mean the revenant room. Practice level designs. It's interesting that you say that, because the person that's mainly responsible for this map pack is working on Proteus. Which I think should be in early access fairly soon. back here. Grab some of this health. Kill some more imps. How did Sigil stack up? Some people think Sigil is too hard. Uh, those people haven't played this. <laughs> they don't know what hard is. <laughs> like, I don't... I mean, Sigil's tough. Don't get me wrong. But it's not, it's not like this. This, this is crazy. Yeah, I didn't find Sigil that tough. I mean, it's gonna be tough to try to do the no death run, though. Alright, so I killed that. I got the blue key. That's like a mega sphere. But I've only played through Sigil once, so I have no, like, strategies for a no death run. This I will never know death run, I'm gonna tell you right now. <laughs> like, I'd have to be really, really bored. 
to even make the attempt, because I don't think I'd get very far. I would rather try a no-death run of blood. Sigil felt more like traditional Doom. It definitely did, like... I mean, the only thing is it kind of felt like a slog here and there because you don't have the super shotgun. And there's no... And instead of Hell Knights, there's Barons, you know what I mean? So there's not many... Like, you're limited by the monster choice, right? So it's like, it's basically either going to be Barons or Kaka Demons. And then without the super shotgun, it's like... You either have to have rockets or plasma or something like that. So I'm glad I'm playing, like, you know, with the super shotgun again. But I mean, like, considering it's all Doom 1 assets... It's that it's probably one as quality as you're gonna get like as a pure doom one map or ultimate doom or whatever He's behind me isn't he? Yeah, I was hoping I could like go in there, you know fire off a shot and then like retreat uh, It's in a read me like he explains it. I didn't read it. I'm sure he's got his reasons. I guess he wanted to, like, stay pure. You know, it's why he didn't add any new enemies or, like, new textures. He wanted to keep it... You know, keep it old school. Because you know, you know the best part about keeping it old school? There's no goddamn revenants. There's none. With their homing ass missiles. So even though you don't get the super shotgun, you don't have to deal with them. Oh, and you don't have to deal with a million arch vials. Stay pure when talking about Doom? You gotta stay pure when you talk about Doom. Then again, I'm not, you know, I'm playing GZ Doom. It's not like I'm playing Chocolate Doom. I, I need my mouse look, okay? I feel like it balances out because I turn off auto-aim. Saw the revenants for the first time. Oh yeah, that's when that, um, you go, you go in that spiral staircase, and then the wall drops and there's those, like, two revenants. See, because I used to play Doom on, like, the Super Nintendo and what, like, the PlayStation stuff, and the Archfile's not in the PlayStation version or the Super Nintendo. Oh, speaking of the devil, the Archfile. Hey, I was switching to the rocket launcher. Oh, the, yo, you're a different Archfile. Okay. Never mind. Damn it, I thought I could, like, hide. This is the best guy. I mean, I could try to rocket them, but, like, odds are I'll kill myself. Actually, no, that was working out. I just screwed up when I took cover. There's no way. So I really gotta wound them before they get that close. I think I killed both of them. So when I finally was able to play like Doom 2 on PC, I was like, man, what's the Archfile all about? And now, now I, I have a very deep understanding of the Archfile, like more than I ever had. 
Thanks to this map pack. Oh, look at that. That's... Oh, what's that supposed to be? Is that supposed to be sexy archvile? Or is this supposed to be archvile? Who knows? It's up to your imagination. That's the beauty of Doom. Oh, God. Archfowl's like, paint me like one of your French girls. Like, okay. <laughs> oh good, Mancubus. Speaking of console versions of Doom, I still want to beat Doom 64. But I don't think I'll- I think what I'll do is I'll play the source port of Doom 64. I don't think I'll actually play it on the N64. Though it runs pretty well on the N64. It's more of like a control preference. Doom 64 is getting a port? I mean, it's already been ported. Like, unofficially. A proper port? I mean, it was done by the guy that did the blood fresh supply port. That's how he got- that's how he got the blood fresh supply gig. Oh, to switch in PS4? Mm. That would make sense, because, like, there's no way they can play it. Alright, let's- let's wound this guy a little bit. So you'd think the Archfile would learn that, like, chain gunners are not his friend. They always seem to wound him and then he has to kill him, and then just to revive them again. They like this Archfile. What, where? Who, who the fuck? Yeah, I think Midway made it. Where the fuck is this chain gunner? Is it one of those invisible, like, res monsters again? Yep. I wonder if that's like a GZ Doom bug, or if that bug was always in Doom. You can't resurrect them as fast as I can kill them! Oh shit. How did I blow myself up? You know, like, you think Nintendo would just like, you know how it has that, um, what's it called? Like if you if you do the Nintendo, the Switch online, you get access to the NES. Why not the N64 and the Super Nintendo and all that other stuff, you know? Like, when you look at, like, Xbox Live and PlayStation Network, they give you, like, a free game every month. Like, if Nintendo did that, I mean, I know they can't do their whole library because of, like, licensing and whatever. Did I kill that dude? Oh, is John Carmack gonna be there? Or is he gonna talk about his space travel stuff? Like, and then I decided to use Thermite to to break the glass so that we could get the computers in the computer room. That's not how he talks. I, I just figured I'd make him sound like that. Yay, he's dead! Woohoo! Joe, I could see that. Oh yeah, he's in VR now. Which I guess at least he's back in like, you know, the tech world. Not that space wasn't important, it's just...
there's just no money in space. That's a, that's the problem. You know, the man's got to pay the bills. He's got like 12 Ferraris that he has to like deal with. Oh no, I actually heard he sold a couple of them. So, you know, it's... Whoa. Yeah, John Carmack's like the real deal. He's like a super nerd. Like, apparently when he was working for id, he, he requested like this like insanely priced computer. Like workstation, like, you know, it was like over two grand. And, and like they gave it to him and then he made Doom. I have all the keys. But I'm, I'm looking for health. Don Romero comments that he operates on a different level. He does seem like that. He cared a lot about games as much as he just did programming math. Well, he always has that same expression in every picture. Like, like he, he's had the same haircut, the same style, everything. Like, he hasn't changed. I mean, he's gotten older. One lonely imp. You killed my friends. It's like, yeah, and I'm leaving you alive to tell the tale. Let's see. Oh, no, wait, there's another imp. Okay. He likes to talk a lot. I mean, yeah. Made the engine, the other guys made a game around it. Yeah, like, it, cause like, Romero seemed like the create, you know, the creative type, like he came up with more of the, like, style and the level design. And Carmack just made sure it ran. This is not the gun to have for this, this particular task. But... It takes too long to switch weapons. Uh, I only got two rockets. What? Oh, it was a homing... Don't you hate that? Like, you dodge the rocket, you're like, yeah, I'm safe, and then, like, it hits you anyways, because it's a homing one. That's why I hate the Revenant. That's why I always try to kill them, like, first, because I know it's going to be one of those rockets. That's what's going to do me in. It's all fleshy in here. Join forces again? What's Romero even doing? I mean, like, yeah, he made Sigil, but, like, is he actually making, like, a game? As an advisor, I mean... Or, or maybe, like, Romero's made so much money, he just doesn't care. He's like, yeah, I can, I can still call myself a game developer. I don't have to do anything. You know, like, the guys that work at Valve. Like, yeah, I mean, you know, Half-Life 3 will come out when it comes out. I'm just gonna just go to work and just whistle. Oh, phone games. Oh. And Facebook games? That's sad. So much potential wasted. Like, I knew people that made Facebook games, you know? And it's just like... 
It's like, they did it for the money. They didn't really care about the games they made. You know, they just like, that's what was popular. So everyone kind of went for it. Oh, okay. He seems to spend a lot of time doing do Doom things anyways. I mean, apparently, he was d d deathmatching quite a lot. You know, instead of working on Quake. <laughs> oh, but he also, what, produced Heretic and the Hexen? But that was like when Raven Software was like right next door to id, like across the street. Yeah, he made Sigil. I mean, it, relatively recently. I mean, it was what, this year? Even way after he quit id? Okay, there's a switch. See, I never got the deathmatching bug when it came to, like, Doom and Quake. But, like, I, I w probably could see it more with Quake. I, I feel like Doom deathmatch would be a little, like... You know, depending on the map and stuff, it's like, at least with Quake you have movement, you know, where you can jump and stuff. So you can, like, dodge things better. You have, like, more freedom to get the hell out of the way of, like, certain attacks. And you can duck. Yeah, I got heavily into Counter-Strike. But then I, like, got more into, like, team-focused games like Battlefield. Feet was pretty fun too. At least the Half Life 1 versions of it. I didn't really like it too much when it went source. Do I even save with 4% HP? Yeah, like, like when it went source, they tried to make it more uh, like a game. Instead of, more, like, more closer to real life, which the Half-Life 1 version was. Also, the Half-Life 1 version had so many, like, kick-ass maps made by the community.
Taurus was your first Counter Strike? Oh, enemy territory? I didn't really play too much of enemy territory, because at the time I was looking for like more realistic type shooters. So I ended up playing a lot of Battlefield Forgotten Hope. Which pretty much has never been topped. Oddly enough. Another one spawned. It was like, oh, you got one? You killed that one? Well, I got another chain gunner in a window. I didn't really get to play uh, Battlefield Vietnam because I was just playing 1942 for the mods. Which is kind of funny because, you know, like Battlefield 2 was basically made by the mod team that made uh, the Desert Warfare game. Which everyone fucking loved, and I was like, man, it wouldn't have been cool if it was like, instead of that, it was Forgotten Hope. Yeah, that, that team, uh, basically would make Battlefield 2. And I played a little bit of Battlefield 2, it had some neat ideas. Was he there? Did he, like... I don't, I, oh, there he is. Okay, yeah, he is there. I was wondering if, like, he got revived by an archvile or something, because I thought I killed everything. See, when I was younger, I always thought mods were better than commercial games, because mods could, like, take risks, and commercial games had to be, like, you know, they had to do shit so that, like, it, w it would be balanced or like, you know, uh, more approachable to like casuals. And you could almost make the argument that it still is like that today. Like mods can be a lot more hardcore. Mods were indie games. That's true, too, because a lot of people, they would they would make a mod and then hopefully get picked up. Or, like, you know, like, work out their ideas using, like, Half-Life or Quake or something. You know, because Team Fortress started as a Quake... a Quake mod. What spawn? Oh, candles? Yeah, I can deal with candles. Yeah, Counter-Strike was originally a mod for Half-Life. It came out after Rainbow Six, so it was basically trying to be Rainbow Six but in the Half-Life engine, but not as strict. And then I think the Counter-Strike team uh, after Counter-Strike worked on uh, Left 4 Dead. And then, like, there was Counter-Strike, and then there was Action Quake. I think Action Quake even predates Counter-Strike. Guys on the right? No? Okay. Yeah, there was also like a Counter Strike clone for Unreal Tournament. I remember that one. That one incorporated bleeding. And then there was Urban Terror for Quake 3, which is now free to play. And I used to play like, you know, Urban Terror, because at that point there was no Counter Strike Source, so it was like. Uh, you know, I'm kind of done with Counter-Strike, but I would like to play something similar that looks a little bit better. And I think the guys that worked at, like, on Urban Terror got jobs at Raven Software.
Which is weird, because now Raven Software is just making nothing but Call of Duty. So it's just, it's basically just making, like, uh, you know, Modern Warfare multiplayer stuff. All a Counter-Strike anyways. See, the reason Call of Duty is so popular is because... That was the first time people on consoles played something that was Counter-Strike-like. You know, where it was like modern weapons, high damage value, stuff like that, right? And, because there were there were attempts to bring Counter-Strike to the consoles, but it never really worked out. Because, I mean, Call of Duty 1 was PC only, but no one cares about that one, right? Except, like, people who played it on the PC. But everyone, like, remembers Modern Warfare and Call of Duty 2 because that was, like, you know, on the consoles as well. The Xbox version of Counter-Strike is supposed to be okay for what it is. You know, you ever hear about the Unreal version or the Unreal Tournament uh, Xbox version? That one had, like, melee weapons. What's up, Gunstar? Is that what it's called? Championship? Let's see. Yeah, nine hours. Can you believe, uh... The stream hasn't crashed? I mean, the game's crashed like four times. Oh, you just got up? Okay. <laughs> Well, I guess thanks for lurking that whole time. All right, so I'm gonna drop down and then follow these candles. Into what's clearly a battle arena of some sort. We took a nap for a couple of hours. this out. I feel safer with it. Oh, look, a uh... What was that? Supercharge. It's still the same map pack, yeah. Yeah, I remember playing the first, like, Call of Duty, um... at QuakeCon. That's when I also first played Doom 3. Uh, the Call of Duty thing that they had at QuakeCon was, like, they took their E3, um, like, like, presentation, which was this World War II Jeep. And th that was there, so that was kind of neat. And I was like, man, iron sights and all this stuff, this is pretty neat. Now it's like, now it's kind of been done to death, you know what I mean? I thought the campaigns were like, okay, but they got like worse as time went on, you know, like the first three like, Call of Duty 1, 2, and Modern Warfare, and then after that, they just kind of got, like, fairly generic. So I, I hit the switch. It opens up this, but that's kind of it. I still don't have access to that. Oh wait, is this a switch? No, that's a thing. They're gonna reboot Modern Warfare. I hear I hear it's gonna be like edgier and grittier. Oh, there's a portal. Oh shit, no, not this. Oh yeah, yeah, this works. Yeah, sure, why not? Yeah, take that. this. And I was just joking with the chainsaw, but it actually kind of like, it worked a little bit. Don't you love how 
how the Doom Marine runs almost as fast as the, um... As his rockets? Hey, what's up, Salamander? Hey, remember the campaign for Middle of Honor? Or as I like to call it, uh, Saving Private Ryan, the video game? Because Steven Spielberg was the producer of Medal of Honor, right? So they just used all the sound effects from the movie and, like, basically the same maps. Doing some work? There you go. Let's try this. It's made by the same devs that made Call of Duty. See, what happened was EA owned Medal of Honor, right? But the devs that, like, worked on Medal of Honor, they wanted to make a grittier World War II game. They wanted to put blood and stuff like that in, and EA at the time was like, no, it has to be team for teen so that we can make money off of it. Even though at the time, all the hottest selling games were rated M for Mature. And then, of course, EA finally caved in, and, you know, after, after they all left and showed that Call of Duty made way more fucking money, that's one of those, like, EA decisions that, like, some idiot in marketing made and then, like, screwed over the company of some, like, very talented developers. Because, you know, you want to make your game T for teen, that way, like, it's a bigger audience. It's like when you make your movie PG-13 instead of R, because it'll make more money. But they don't do it because of an artistic uh, reason, they do it because it's like, oh, more people can like, you know. You didn't play the original, but played the 2010? Oh. Yeah, but those were done by DICE. Went back to Activision again, uh. Let's go, let's try this. Oh, look at that. Well, that's... Uh-huh. Alright, here we go. Just put- get this out. Okay. How many? How many? Five cyber demons? Is that it? Is that all you got? You like the idea is all shooters were adult labeled? That's what's really bizarre and that's what's sort of going on now with like Fortnite, you know, because it has like that cartoon violence so people are okay with it. You know, or like, like, kidifying shooters, which it's, I think it's kind of like, I mean, you know, an art style is an art style, but at the same time, it's kind of like, are we, is it less desensitizing, whatever, to like, make it, like, cartoony? I mean, yeah, you're right, I mean, and, well, also that and Marilyn Manson music, we really gotta ban that. Cause, you know, I mean, like, like, the world was perfect before Doom. And all the violent games and all that, like, rock music that kids listen to. <laughs> yeah, he did. What was really bizarre about that, though, was, like... Um, during the Columbine, like, shootings, right, like, M Manson had, like, a tour going, and then he canceled his tour. And I'm like, why would you do that? It's not your fault. You know? Like, like, that, that doesn't make sense. 
you know, out of, out of, like, you know, in reverence to what happened, but it's like, yeah, but that's like almost admitting fault for it. You know, it's just like how ESPN canceled, um, what was it, an Apex Legends, like, tournament they were gonna broadcast because of all the shootings that have happened. Because now, violent video games are now the hot topic again because, you know, politicians like to, like the distraction of it. God, I was so close. It's kind of always been like that in ours. The biggest problem, I think, comes with the fact that, like, the people that make decisions are really out of touch. the day, you know, for, like, music, right? Like, Twisted Sister, and, like, Frank Zappa had to go to the Senate, or whatever, and, like, defend the set, like, them censoring music, and then there was the whole, like, um, violent video game thing with Night Court, I mean, not Night Court, Night Trap, the Night Trap hearings, you know, and then they were, like, get on, like, uh, you know, Nintendo's case for making a zapper gun and all that. It's like, you're teaching kids how to shoot things. And it's like, hey, were we gonna talk to the NRA? No, 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 you see, because, like, guns make money. It's like, oh, okay. <laughs> it's like, it's like, way to circumvent a lot of the bullshit. Oh, I thought I could get it. Yeah, I can go to Walmart and buy a shotgun. And I don't even need to, like, get, uh, what's it called? Like, I, like, they're not rated M for, well, I guess they are rated M for mature. You gotta be at least 18. But... Rated T for teen. Did I not grab the health? Fuck. <laughs> well, I, I, again, I kind of blame, like, the, the problem is there's, like, a lot of, like, um, like, small groups of people that have a lot of political power, you know, um, and the country was founded by primarily Puritans. So you got all these, like, church groups and stuff that, like, are able to rally together. And, like, they matter because they vote together. So it's like politicians kind of cater to them. At least one. Okay, where's the fourth one? He's either dead or right behind me. We also have to realize that the majority of America, like the majority of the states in America, like, um, have less population than the city of LA, like the whole state. So like, there's like big cities, but then there's like this big like middle part where like pretty much nobody lives and it's very rural. So people tend to think the same way and they tend to like, you know, nothing really changes. And they call that values. Oh my 
god, they're all dead. because I thought it was over! I thought it was over! <laughs> I mean, I was like, how can you top? Four fucking cyber demons. Oh, that's right, four arch vials. That's how you top it. Now they're guarding that plasma ammo. chainsaw out. Alright, Nars, you have a good one. Thanks for hanging out. Grab that. Okay, good. Hey, at least they don't have a chain gun. I got 12 shells. Hmm. All right, here we go. Here goes nothing. Oh, they come out from there. sucks when you can't see. I wish I had like one rocket or one BFG shot. not safe. Oh, and there's one right in front of me. Oh, fuck. Oh, 
god, they're behind me! Oh, wait, where the fuck did you come from? How many are there? I think there's four, but it seemed like there were five. Unless they can res themselves, which I don't think they can. Oh good, yeah, bring those guys back. I miss them. Maybe just like unload with this. Get some pot shots in. What's up, Anthiki? Like, yeah, luckily they don't revive cyber demons. Could you imagine? So, so they showed some restraint. Two percent. That's a, those four arch files. Slave. All right, Nipple Jesus, you have a good one. What map am I on? Map twenty-five. I'm more than halfway through. There's there's only 32 maps, right? Like there has to be. Usually a megawatt is 32. I'm already stuck. Is this what they mean by slave? I go through the waterfall now. Or it's like, we knew that you cheesed out those arch files, and this is your punishment. Yeah, I've tried using stuff. Like, after that, after all those fights are gonna give me, like, a how do you get out of this room puzzle? And by puzzle, I mean, like... Is there something I'm supposed to shoot? What about... Can I shoot that? How about that thing? No? What if I had no ammo? I'd be fucked. Nope, I, I'm definitely a slave. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> Man, wouldn't it be great if the map is just try to get out of this room? Like all this other stuff, it's like, yeah, that doesn't matter. You just, you know, once you get out of the room, the map's over.
Well, I'm stumped. Really? Okay, well, that, that solved that. That was like just the last, I was like, I might as well punch some walls and oh. Okay, well that's done. <laughs> uh-huh, okay, invisible floors, nice. Hey, look, there's the exit. All I gotta do is just run towards there. That was the map, and just get out of the room! That's <laughs> what a great map! That was fantastic! It's like, choose, but choose wisely. Choose the form of your destroyer. Uh-huh. I don't know, it just, it just kind of popped in there. What, what just popped in there? The Stay Puff Marshmallow Man. Okay, I'm gonna rocket jump into the portal. All right, about, about there, okay. Oh, oh, yeah, take that! Take that map! <laughs> Who's the slave now? Oh my god, I made it! We're at the last episode. And would you believe it? It's even fucking harder than the shit that I just did. But I mean, look at it. Was it worth it? it I think it was. I mean, look at this. On the part time for that was four minutes. So clearly that's not, that's <laughs> Some would say that was cheating, but I'm like fuck that I earned that I know this looks amazing uh, Look how big this map is too But get guess what they gave me a pistol because you know pistol start and a berserk and that's it. So my reward is to punch the shit out of these knights. There's a BFG. Oh, another berserk, that's good, and some armor. Let's grab this BFG. should be a piece of cake. Blood is its own type of hell. Alright, let's fight. Let's go. Come on. Fuck. Let's go over here and grab that armor. down here. I mean, 
mean stairs. Yeah, all right, let's go get that BFG. <laughs> I'm gonna kind of go over here. Sounds like it's from Pokemon. This level's called Transcendence! Oh my god, there's these guys. Oh yeah, they warp in behind, I forgot about that. Shoot one of these for fun! Got one more shot. Chain gun. Don't worry, that revenant reven like he got, you know, he got even for me. He avenged my death. I can play King of the Stairs. shot it. Some more cell energy. That gives me another shot. Let me, let me save. I, I don't know if this is good or bad, but I'm still alive, so. That's just what I needed, guys. That's... Fucking no! A oh, good cell ammo. Alright. Well, that. That's good. Good stuff. Oh, good. More of that. Oh, that's not good, though. I don't like that.
26. So there's four more maps after this? Two secret maps. I, what, what, how? Getting destroyed is what's happening. Get the rockets. Okay, nothing triggers when I get the rockets. I don't need that health pack now. Gotta save it. So, what triggers is when I get the big, um... The big cell pack. Oh, I didn't see him there. Shot pattern. And they're really fast. past everything. Yeah, but then I rush past everything and then there's more monsters! Like, at the end of the day, I'm still gonna get swamped. gun? I, I don't have any ammo for it anymore. Oh, I ran over their heads. I Frank West that shit. Oh, here we go. Now I got some ammo. things. The door over upstairs is open. Seems easy enough. Okay, how many enemies are- 490 enemies are in this level. There is no, like, escape. See, that's what I'm talking about. Like, even if I use the energy gun, eventually I'm gonna wind up with, like, pretty much nothing. Nothing. 
Because they're going to follow me, is the thing. And then I'm going to be even more outnumbered. Which is what they do. Like, look, see, well, well not those guys, but... Especially the flying creatures. Well, that's true, you don't beat the game by killing everything. But I'm just saying, like, it's not... Running past them doesn't really work, because then you end up fighting more guys at once. Then it just, like, compounds it. Because even if I run past these guys, I'm gonna get followed by the guys that I've already done, right? And now I'm out of bullets, so now there's this guy. Yeah, but that's assuming that the ending is anywhere near here. See what I mean? Like, look, there's more guys. So, you know, my options are to run to this guy or run to that guy. I won't find out by dying in one spot. Yeah, but if I kill him, then I get, can get the ammo and shit. That's how slaughter maps work. close to the end. That has to be that tower. Get past the shit. Oh, I'm sorry, the god. Have you been playing this game for nine hours, fighting, like, all this bullshit? I didn't know you were the master of slaughter maps. Hey, everyone! The god knows how to beat this level. All I gotta do is just run past everything. It's that easy. So easy. Here, I'll go do it right now. I didn't know we were the master of fucking slaughter maps. How many slaughter maps have you beaten? Name the big wads, I wanna hear it. You beat Plutonia, you beat TNT Evolution. Did you do all that? Did you beat the first 26 maps of this, like, ridiculous map pack? The entire map pack has been brutal. Like, ask anyone who's been watching me play this. Or anyone who, like, has played something similar to this. Like, I have done the best I can to survive all the way up to here. But it's not like it's a straightforward path. This is not your normal map. Like, the developers thought of that. So they're purposely, like, putting stuff in my way to make sure that I can't just run past most of it. Yeah. Basically what Bard Zerker says, like, there's always another obstacle. It's not like I just ran past the big bad guys. There's more bad guys. Crap. And then the game crashes because there's so many bad guys. Discard, launch it again. Oh my god.
It might be, because I, you know what, maybe I should take this fresh, or maybe I should just say, I got to level 25. I got, I got to the afterlife. How much more could, like, what, what is the next couple of levels? Like, what could that possibly be? Oh yeah, the door did open, you're right. But there's nothing in- oh. Never mind. That's it? Oh, there's a switch. Wow. You know, that's what I was thinking, because, like, I, I'm wondering about the guys that made the map, right? Because they had to test these maps. And, like, this map in particular is a pistol start. Like, it doesn't matter. You always start with just nothing but the pistol. I have one shot. So it makes me wonder, like... They have to have tested this, you know what I mean? And on Ultraviolent, because Ultraviolent gives you the max amount of monsters. But the thing is, when it's like this, it's like, where do you go? What do you do? And it's weird, too, because there's all these paths, and it's like, I don't know which one, like, I'm supposed to tackle, or whatever. Where they just made the map and let the community test it? Uh. Yeah, you're right, none of them beat their own levels. I got two shots. And I, I wasted that one. Oh, I got some of these. Looks like Russian... Yeah, but there's more mobs! That's the thing, it's like eventually I have to deal with them anyways. Also, using the rocket, the 32 rockets against the imps, I can get, I can get that energy from them. Because they guard, like, like, two of these. So I don't really need to waste the BFG on the imps. Though these guys... Ah, they got me. Yeah, that too. Usually you have to go back, like, back to previous areas. See, like, this door here, maybe it opens and I have to come back here anyways. <laughs> so now I gotta, like, think about... Because, again, these imps, they die fairly fast to rockets, right? So I can cut through there and then I can get some energy cells for the BFG. As long as I don't get cornered by the specters and their shields. Because the other problem is... Yeah, they also keep locking doors. Sometimes they trap you in the area. Because, like, right now I got 60 cells. That's going to raise it up to, like, 160, but that's not enough shots. I think it's because it's very, like, RPG-like. Or that medieval RPG feel.
Just trying to thin out the herd so I can get over there and get that, that ammo. Alright, now use it. I hope it kills those... Okay, it killed one of them. Or two of them. Did I waste it? I'm saving, though. Three rockets. So my options are either go up there, go down... Well, there's ammo down here. The other thing I can do is I can kind of use the enemies to kill each other a little bit. See, like, how these imps are right here? Oh, damn. Try to get him in a crossfire with that cyber demon, so that the cyber demon kills a couple of them with his rockets while I get this ammo. Two. How did I kill myself? There wasn't even an invisible monster in front of me, hello? I don't want to waste it on just one flying enemy. gives me a hundred health. Cyber demons doing here. I guess. I guess hell got. I mean, heaven got invaded, or at least the afterlife, or, or whatever. Ten percent health. Oh, huh? well, there's health over here. So there we go. I got one stim pack. Got this other stim pack. There's also arachnatrons. They're down there somewhere. Yeah, they're. Yeah. They're tanking my frame rate. That's what. Oh God. It's like someone was like, hey, you know that game's serious, Sam? I, I think I think I could outdo it. Oh, really? How do you, you going to do that one? I don't know. Like, maybe like 300 ifs. Oh, that doesn't sound like serious enough. Okay, well, let's make him sure he has like no ammo and has to punch shit. Uh-uh. 
Shoot him from the mountain? I don't want to waste the ammo! <laughs> Like, I, I'm trying not to kill things that I don't need to kill, that aren't, like, immediately in my way. So, th there's a big chain attached to this switch. When I do this, does something happen to the big chain, or does this asshole just show up? Because I don't want to waste the- Ah, oh, man. Alright, let's go this way. What's- what's in here? Bunch of arachnotrons. Oh, but they die in one shot! So, interesting thing. Did you know how the BFG works? It's not the ball that does damage. It's if they're in my line of sight when the ball explodes. So I have to be looking at the enemy for it to cause damage. If, if I'm, like, if I'm not looking at him, then it won't do shit to him. Might as well just shoot this now. Man, it's the homing one that gets me, but if I juke around like these columns correctly, then the homing ones won't get me. It's still following me, isn't it? Okay. Can't go up there. Lots of projectiles. Alright. Let's get this rocket launcher then, because at least it's something. I get that. Perhaps if I do this. So I got 30 rockets. Oh, these guys are over here. It followed me. All dead. How are they still... How are they still alive?! All those BFG shots, you think, like... Well, let's go up here. Oh, look, it's nice. Get some armor, all these rockets. That's good stuff. Oh, here, let me get out this gun. I can go to the garden now? Oh shit. Whatever the fuck's that all about. Oh 
Okay, well, I got some health. Oh, of course. <laughs> oh! Zombie men! <laughs> this is like all the other maps, like, condensed into madness. There's so many places to go! That's the other thing, too. Because of the ammo, I'm gonna try that left, left place. Then they- I gotta get out of here! Damn it. Yeah, you'd think this would be like the final map. But no, there's more maps after this, and it's like, what could the next map be? Are you just gonna give me a berserk? And then I gotta like, punch out like five or eight cyber demons? While there's like towers of chain gunners shooting at me, because I mean, like, I, I can see that happening. One imp is final boss. Oh, wouldn't that be great? Shit, shit. It's like you can't escape. They blocked off your escape path. just rush to the end. Yeah, but they designed it so you couldn't just rush to the end. For instance, this part right here, where, like, I have to kill them to, to exit, because they block my path. They block all the paths, like, all the exits. to this place. I'm gonna BFG them. They're too dangerous. Take the elevator. Right now, there's a switch. Or did I already do the switch? I don't remember. I mean, I know I did the switch, but I don't, I don't know if it was part of this. Why, why are rockets exploding, like, right where I am? I must have already did the switch. So, my guess is there's, you know, for each of these chains, there's a switch, right? See, there's that switch, and then there's, so there's three switches that I have to get to, and that I have to activate. And every time I activate a switch, of course, more shit spawns. Woo! And how do I get to that other switch?
no, 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 no. That's a bad place. there's like no they're all the guns in this are like bfg and rocket that's it that's this whole level up the stairs again Okay, I can save here. That gives me a breather. That also lures the surviving caca demons over here, and I can kind of run past them. Except for that asshole, because he's really fast. Some cell ammo. There we go. They're all over there. There's no switch over there, so fuck that. I don't think I hit that switch. Okay, now to get the hell out of here. So that leaves one more switch. But I don't know how to get to that one. It's like the one right in the middle. I'd just like to come back here because I can save. See, like, at first I thought it was up here. Aha! Well, at least I got that orb. Okay, there's that chain, and there's this chain. It goes to this. Which is why I've been doing this. Oh good, an arch file. That's what this map was missing. And he can hit me from all the way across the map, too. That's even better. 
So... Hmm... So now to figure out what that chain, like... Me hitting all the chain switches did. Doesn't seem to open up anything here. I don't know where the door is. Unless there's a final chain switch, which I don't see. It looks... Oh, maybe this place. No, that's locked. Nice. There's a rocket launcher. Maybe it has something to do with this tower. Oh no, I hit that switch. Oh wait! fuck is this shit? Oh, are there more switches by the switch? You gotta be kidding me. Now there's like two arch files over there. Well, that's fine. I got like, I got plenty of ammo for this. Let's... I gotta go buy every other switch. So they added two extra switches that are timed, I guess, so that you'd have to stay there and not just hit the switch and run away. Damn, Cacodemon! He body blocked me. That's yeah, quite- it's like an epic map. <laughs> Shit, he still saw me. Go up here. Shit! It took my time. a speed run. I bet you if I looked on YouTube, there's like one guy. Oh my god, the tower falls. The tower falls! The way is open. Oh, look at this. Really? Really? 
Hey, hold, hold on. I'm saving. You lied to me! This is not an exit! Oh, well, I guess it is. Okay, I'm in the circle. Yep. Oh, that was the exit. 94%! 94%! Oh, Heliopolis! Okay. You know, you know, it'd be nice if they gave me a pistol. Oh, wait, no, I got one of those. What's over here? Oh, a shotgun! There is a shotgun in heaven. What's going on there? Okay, so now bullets are useful. Go back, get some ammo. There's a whole bunch of clips over here. Nip Nipopopolis from South Park. Oh, that that that's that's another type of mod. They're all dead. Yeah, he had a clip. Here we go. There we go. That really, that hurt him. No. Ah, I got stuck on him. That's right, I still got one of these.
Don't you want to bet it's going to be that imp with the fireball that kills me? Okay, made it this far. Like sometimes you're busy fighting the stuff that's right in front of you and then something from like all the way across the map hits you just because it's in a tower. That's okay, I got the double barrel now, so so it's all good. It's carried me this whole time. Like, if there was no double barrel, I don't think I could have made it this far. To be honest. Like, it just would have been... Just too, too much. Six hundred cell ammo. The other question is, should I drop down and get that? Nah, probably not. Hey, what's up, Ginger Vitus? Oh, it's the same map pack I was playing last night. It's still Evil Eternity. Aztec Doom. Uh, yeah, it's kind of that and like a little bit of Greek. Ancient Greece. can't jump. Like, I pressed the jump button, but he won't jump, so there's no jumping. Some, some they allow jumping, some they don't. to go in the garage and I'm like no Oh, God. Oh. Uh, so let's 
get that. More like handles. I can see a cat learning how to do that. cat figures out how to, like, lockpick, then you're in deep trouble. You know, haven't you ever heard of a cat burglar? Aha! Uh -huh. Okay, I'm done with that. That's luck. That's the only one I got. <laughs> I'm allowed one of those at least once per stream. Shit. Eight health and eight armor. That's good. It's been on every map. Yeah, it's, it's usually just me under ten health. No, I don't have Berserk, though. It's harder here. Good. You know what? Sergeants, there's no, re there's no reverend. Oh God, I, man, I've been up a while. There's no revenants or whatever. Oh, so, you know, they're only in hell, where they belong. Coward Capo. He didn't die with his friends. There will be no honor for him. No. Now what am I saying? The last level there was a shitload of them. <laughs> like, I guess I just blocked it out. Alright, 20 bullets. That's enough. No caco emote. Should I get the caco emote? That's the thing, is I can only have like five better Twitch TV emotes. I don't know which one I'd, I'd have to get rid of. I got a little 
price for those guys. Here we go. Okay, so I, I got that health pack up if I ever need it. Plasma gun. Yeah, at first I thought this was like the start of the level again, but no, this is a different area. The hell was shooting at me? A team of Archvile and oh, two Archviles. Okay, all right. Now they're both gonna fight the Cyber Demon, but the Cyber Demon is still gonna try to shoot me because the Archvile attack doesn't count. Look at him go. I could just wait this out. No, they can't revive a cyber demon. There are limits to their power. They can revive other stuff around the cyber demon, that's fine. Unless it's the guy with the shotgun. The Archvile, it's a cyber demon. Some direct hits. I do think, though, if you get a direct hit with the ball, it does a little bit more damage. Man, they resurrected that shotgunner like a million times. And then the cyber demon just kept killing him. At least that's my theory as to why there were so many shotguns there. Can I get on this wall? No. Oh, whoa. Whoa, one one zombie man. I better better be careful. I wanna I wanna get in trouble there.
Shotguns go to heaven. Hey, remember the rock in the Doom movie? Whose bright idea was it to put the rock in the Doom movie and then not have him be the Doom Marine? What genius thought of that? even funnier though if the rock did play the doom marine but he never took off his helmet you know what i mean like it's it's just him in the helmet the whole time and he never says anything that would have been the shit that would have been amazing Oh, I don't I don't have enough for the BFG. Oh, that's right. I had to kill a cyber demon. this, aren't I? Hardcore Henry. It, oh, but isn't that the one that's all in first person? That would have been even more badass if they, if they filmed it all in first person. <laughs> and just used the rocks like hands. <laughs> As Dwayne Johnson's Mega Man. Rockman Plus. Oh my god. I never thought of that. Oh, I want that. But I gotta get on the wall to do that. How do you get on this wall? Don't come over here. There's something over here that you want. Don't, don't come anywhere near these Hell Knights. Just a random arch while watching his favorite Revenant dancer. Uh, that, that's what those knights were. They were the bouncers. Oh, no, never mind. These are the bouncers. And when they take two? Ironically, you think? I mean, yeah, because he's done such a great job with every other video game <laughs> movie he's been given. Make it? Yes. Oh no, that was not what I wanted. That's not good. Amazingly, I'm not dead yet. I'm still alive somehow. Don't know how that's happening. Uh, 
Alright, this looks like the end now. Gotta be careful here, gotta get that armor. Or that, yeah, there we go. I'll kill him over here where he can't be revived. That's your vengeance. Yeah, you ever see those YouTube videos where he's like, you need to fund my movie. And like, and then he takes like a big sip out of his like, uh, like McDonald's cup or whatever. And then he just makes fun of the Avengers and how it's a shitty movie compared to his movies. Pretty good. Like, I, I, I don't know. See, people say he purposely makes bad movies. Because he makes more money making bad movies than he does making good movies, but maybe he really believes he's good at movies. I don't know. Remember, he made the Postal movie. Which I have never seen. Then again, I'm not the biggest Postal fan. Oh good, it's one of those invisible assholes. Okay, I killed it. Like, apparently, the Archfile will resurrect someone and they'll be invisible. Nothing happened? Oh, I, I guess they were like, well, you know, we already... Oh, no, there it is. Didn't, didn't I just do this? Alright, well, what could it be? Could it be... Oh. Well, it's that too, but like, it's like the producers, right? If you get investors to invest in your movie, and then like the movie flops, you don't have to pay back your investors. You just take all that money that the investors gave you. I mean, we, we gotta remember, this guy made two parody movies of his shitty movies. Right, he made, he made, um, well, what's it called, Flubberella? Which is just Blood Rain, but with a fat girl? And then, um, House of the Dead funny version, which is just bloopers from House of the Dead. Like his idea of comedy is like, well now instead of real guns you will have water guns. That would be hilarious. Yes, I'm Ube Ball. Like all artists, I'm not appreciated my own time. Oh shit. How am I supposed to get past this? Well, get the Hail Mary gun. Right, here we go. Fuck. Right, at least the Spider Mastermind doesn't bring shit back to life.
the spider demon. Son of a bitch. I have a lot of health. What, you mean like stashed away somewhere? Because I don't think I do. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. That was a slip. Nope, none here. If I just keep like, it's like an onion, if I just keep peeling away at him. Oh yeah, you're right, in comparison to what I usually have. Chain gunner with the BFG, no, no, that he had to live. Oh, I thought that was box rockets. Sergeants. I mean, in the game, you know, I mean, obviously. What? Oh god, there's a health sphere. Guarded by one Kako. And there's like a big med pack here so I can come back here. Jet, that was that was dumb. Save that for the big spider. They're all dead. Yeah, in what, like 40 minutes, I'll hit the 12 hour mark? Playing Doom for 12 hours straight. <laughs> oh, that's good. Oh, that's fine. Yes, I've proven. I've proven that I have no life. I've played Doom for 12 hours straight. Top that! Alright, I got that. Dead. Where's the big spider, though? I don't know. I was, I was just kind of on a roll with this. Or, like, I was just always interested, you know? Like, because the levels, like, they look nice, but they're also, like, stupidly challenging. But it's like I keep having to try and, like, figure out how to get by all this crap. Okay, there it is. Well, that's made it engaging. Like I said, like, Doom's a game I could, like, play indefinitely. That was direct. 
Usually it takes three. Alright, now, is there more health? How long am I going to s I don't know. I do know that, it, like, if I do beat this, like, level pack, I'm gonna end it. You know what I mean? Like... Cause, cause why start something else, you know what I mean? Like, just, like, just end it, end it there. And then take a break, and then if I'm still up, and I feel like playing something, then I guess I'll stream again, I don't know. I, I didn't expect to be streaming this long, I was just like, you know, I just feel like playing more of the- I- I was gonna beat one episode. And then now I'm on like the last episode. 12 hours of blood, oh my god. Yeah, I played Death Wish, episode 3. No health items. There probably is like one health item around here, but... Aha! Oh, I don't get the transcendence? Judgment. How many more maps are there? Let me look. 28. So there has to be two more maps. I don't think I've done a secret map. There are two secret maps and 30 normal maps. Wonder how long it took for the developers? Their entire lives, not. I, I think it was like... It says so on like the Realm, uh, what's it called? 667 site. Yeah, the soundtrack's nice. I'll be honest as well, like if the maps didn't look as good as they were and the soundtracks weren't as catchy, I'd probably just like, I would've ended it a lot sooner. I'm totally dead, yeah. I'm getting sloppier though, I've noticed. Now, why even get that when there's a, a Mega Sphere? Rockets. So there's there's cyber demons here. You know, I could do that thing that like other streamers do where it's like, alright, I hit the 12 hour mark. Now whoever donates 10 bucks, I'll do another hour, and then you know just kill myself doing that. Oh shit! <laughs> uh, uh overtime is what it's called, I guess. Oh my god, fuck that. Fuck that guy. Oh, and then they spawn in right there? That's great. Okay, alright. Let me get my... Do it on overtime stream. Oh, look at him. Look at him up there in his fucking tower. He thinks he's so much better than us. Now why don't you come down here with the plebs, huh? Rockets. 
Why can't I not grab him? There we go. Hmm. Okay, let's let's hang out here. Actually, no, I can't hang out here. How about here? Yeah, here it looks safe. Okay. Then a rocket comes and kills me, and then I'm like fucked. Oh, okay, I'm gonna get this out. Let's do that again, but this time we hit the arch file. Cyber Demon, you're welcome. What a nice guy. I guess he's not so bad after all. Demons. Well, I guess it could be worse. They could be arch files. That would be really annoying. Megasphere. That going. Gotta remember that you grab that Megasphere when I'm like really low on health. Which should be pretty soon. I mean, I, I have a feeling. Oh shit, that was a bad save. The Cyber Demons have entered the battle. They've entered the fray. No, it's 
It's serious business. Oh, good. Uh, grab some of that out of here. Just go to town on that cyber demon. Yeah, you get him. I believe in you. Oh shit, he's dead. Fuck. Got one down. Yeah, I got all the keys. So, you think if I hit the switch, you think more monsters are gonna spawn? Probably. Now to go get that blue armor. He, he was one brave revenant. You gotta give him credit, man. He went toe to toe with the cyber demon. Hand to hand. But the cyber demon don't play that. He's like, I don't have. You know, I don't take splash damage, I'll just shoot you with my rocket launcher. I don't care. My hide is too thick for splash damage to hurt me. Let me get this out. There we go. Oh, shit! Oh look, there's the big one! There it is! Oh shit! Demon, I do take splash damage. Oh my god, it's and there's like a revenant back there too guarding it. I should have killed those cyber demons with rockets, huh? Save the BFG for this. Damn it. I'm gonna go with 
with that because the problem with using the rockets is the splash damage might kill me. But using the double barrel shotgun, like, I'm bound to hit something, like, that's for sure. Thin out the herd. I mean, that's what I'm trying to do. I'm. They are fighting each other, but even then, there's like more keep warping in. I'm trying to stay on the outskirts and not get like, uh, like blocked off. I should hide behind the, that big uh, spider demon. If everyone was a projectile based, right? It looks like they killed the shit out of that spider demon. <laughs> like, immediately. But then again, it's such a big target that, like, every projectile hits it, you know what I mean? If I, like, run right by it. the key too because it basically with that chain gun it aggros everyone oh damn I was too concerned with the chain gun shots oh man I saw that too
Oh, it's a cyber demon. Is it? It is nuts. Like, let me tell you. I'm trying to get him to fight that cyber demon. Get this health here. I might as well take some pot shots. Well, that's good to know. I'm glad you guys are having fun. I, I was always worried. It's like, because a lot of it is just me dying constantly. Make a lap here. Hopefully that splash damage. Actually, let's use this time to kill all the cacos. Especially those. Those are the worst. He's dead. All right. So now, what I, what I'm dealing with now is just like one cyber demon and like two cacos, and I just saw that I have health. Or I could just run past him and see if you fuck it. <laughs> I think, not, yeah, you know what, I'll, I'll leave that 1%, that's fine. I'm okay with that. Elysium! I finally made it, I've made it to Elysium! What I do now echoes throughout eternity. Uh, map 29, there's a map after this. Almost looks like a heretic map. I, oh, stairs. You know what? I'm not taking the bait. What do you think of that? Oh, nice. Look, look at this! There's more map! Whee! Okay, I'm not hit, I'm not hitting that switch. I'm going over here now. Don't worry, I have the Sword of Light, also known as the BFG. Got me going there for a second. I was like, oh, one zombie man. Oh, that was a lot of nothing. There was shit behind me, too. <laughs> it's like I was about to switch weapons, and then, like, then the cyber demon showed up. And I was like, oh, okay. Warp in there, all right. Hopefully, hopefully you get hit by some rockets. Woohoo! I'm gonna get over here where there's cover. Oh shit! 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 Just let me just hang out over here. Oh 
One zombie man. He, he was the privileged one. He, he got to be here to help the Cyber Demon Generals. Now watch his beard gives me wings. Woo! -hoo. Let me just use these guys as a shield. Let them let them duke it out for a bit. Can a cyber demon fight another cyber demon? Man, that'd be sweet. take him down. They're trying to. No, he just he just destroys him. Hopefully they hurt him a little bit. Oh good, a revenant with homing fireballs. I mean, they throw a lot of shit at me, but they do give me a lot of ammo to deal with it. Though it kind of helped that I, I didn't really shoot a lot during that Cyber Demon encounter. I just had the Hell Knights get thinned out by the Cyber Demons. Sell ammo. Uh, there's the wing thing again. <laughs> I don't like this. I don't like the, like the cramped area. Oh, especially that. Yeah, I don't, I'm not not really fond of that. The jump pad mechanic. Let's get this out. Uh, 
what what could I possibly fight here? A cyber demon. Oh shit! Hey, where are you guys? I was too busy checking out that one revenant. <laughs> Grab this. Get as many pot shots as I can off the cyber demon. use the BFG, but I want to save the BFG for the, like, very last moment. try to push through. Or I could go over here and hang out with the Cyber Demon, be like best buds. How you doing, Cyber Demon? Oh, I'm doing okay, you know, I was just hanging out. Doing Cyber Demon shit. Alright, let me just get on, your, on all their heads, there we go. Did they kill the cyber demon? I, I don't know. So all the revenants are dead. The cyber demon's still alive, though. And there's one in, but you know. 